it has been close to four years that he has been chief minister. And uh, I wanted to actually turn to governance under Yogi Ji. And uh, we will, of course, come to some specific areas in just a bit. Uh, but I wanted to ask you, um, you know, uh, how has, what have been some of the major developments in terms of governance in these four years that you see? So you're right. In March, he took the oath in March third week. And this March, he will be completing four years. And this will be kind of the election year. No? Last year is called the election year, right? And this four years for anyone who has lived, followed Uttar Pradesh, right, uh, as a citizen or as an analyst, they can tell that there's a sea change. There's a sea change. What Uttar Pradesh has seen in the last 15 years of Mulayan Singh Yadav, Mayavati, and Akhilesh Yadav rule is a sea change. So first six months started Kamal with hygiene, right? Like come to offices nine o'clock. I'll tell you a basic example. Like it seems a lot of people, a lot of officers tell me uh, with an oath of privacy <laughs> that I'll not reveal. So I'll not name. They say the first call from Akhilesh Yadav's office used to call, come at 12 o'clock, two o'clock times, right? And the first call from Yogi Atanath's office had come at 7, 13, 8 o'clock in the morning, right? So that tells you a seed difference of a discipline. I'll tell you one more very interesting example. So, you know, a cabinet meeting, right? Every, 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 every chief minister has a cabinet, which have cabinet minister and, and the secretaries involved. So the cabinet note used to go to the house of every, every cabinet minister and get signed in Akhilesh at this time, right? Because cabinet, cabinet note has to be signed, right? But in, in, in Yogi Atanath's time, every cabinet meeting goes on for all, at least one and a half, two hours. And there's argument, counter argument, things are settled and then only things are passed, right? That's how serious or non-serious the governance was then. And that's how serious the gov governance is now. Taking a few, few very prominent thing, which is helping UP to bring back its prosperity, because that's more important. Until the state is not prosperous, that will lead to law and order issues, that will lead to poverty generally, Right? And the more dependence on government also. right? So prosperity needs roads, amazing network of roads. Akhilesh Yadav till today keeps singing about one road that he has built. Right? Similarly, like five, six projects are going on and some of them will be completed before the election. Some of them are already completed. Purvanchal Expressway, Bundelkhand Expressway, these are the expressway. But again, small roads. Are. So roads network is uh, getting amazingly solid. Coming to power, electricity. For, for running, for running a, a prosperous state, you need electricity. right? Now Uttar Pradesh is becoming a power surplus or power neutral state. Uttar Pradesh in Mayavati's and Akhilesh's time was run on a, it was called a power roaster. Roaster means kaha batti aayegi, kaha batti kategi, where the electricity will come and where the electricity will be cut. And where the electricity will come will, will depend on the constituencies of the senior, senior leaders. Right? That, that was the only management was done. Right? Where, in which festival electricity will come, which festival electricity will not come. Now, every, every unit, be it, be it a town, be it an urban area, be it a district headquarter, or be it a village, getting six to eight hours of extra more electricity. So what electricity, let's say a village is getting 14 hours of electricity, now it's getting 18 to 20 hours of electricity. A district headquarters is getting 18 hours of electricity, now getting 22 to 24 hours of electricity. And urban headquarters, 24 hours of electricity. And you know what is the check? Go to any industrial area, and they will tell how their diesel genset bills have come down drastically, right? Because diesel genset bills are only required when there's no electricity, right? And that's a perfect way to measure. And I, I have done this random checking with various industries, right? So power is coming uh, uh, superbly well. Now coming to welfare schemes, all the welfare schemes of central government, right? Are amazingly implemented in UP. Be, be, be it the gas, a uh, gas withdrawn, the, the gas stove and gas cylinder withdrawn, be it the toilet uh, scheme, be it the... Uh, Pradhan Mandri, Avas Yojana, all of them, right? What UP has done, ex extension of Narendra Modi's idea of one nation, one card, means one ration card, right? In Uttar Pradesh, the ration cards were not Aadhaar seated, right? And without Aadhaar seating, there's a lot of theft of grain. The ration shop owner was a Malik. He used to give money. He used to give ration. He used to not give ration. He used to announce that ration has come. He used to not announce. And now, sitting today, in just three and a half years, all the 2022 crore people, Russian, Russian uh, holders, got Aadhaar verified. And 97 to 98% per, uh, percent transaction, as, as, as we are sitting today, are happening through Aadhaar. Right? Government of UP is saving almost 1,000 to 1,200 crores every month, in which was lost in theft, grain theft, uh, earlier. Right? Now, the SMS should come. And sitting in Lucknow, Yogi Atanath can see which person have taken how, many, how much grains, uh, and which kind of grains and on which date and which Kotedar, Kotedar is the work for uh, uh, the ration shop owner, which uh, Kotedar got which much, uh, how much ration on which date. And all of those 80,000 shop has a POS machine 
which is like superbly managed right and this kamal helped immensely in the covid time right when covid time there are two problems one is the ration second is the job job i'll come to how in manrega they very smartly managed that how manrega job cards have increased tremendously in the covid time and second how the ration will be delivered because they had this uh, uh, this aadhar seeding that's why the uh, up government is able to manage even covid brilliantly right so i'm saying very many stories uh, you asked me some generic ones so i told you top of my head but again if you ask me specifically i can tell you various other uh, sectors uh, that up has gained in namaste we hope you enjoyed this chitti media content please remember to subscribe to us and switch on the notifications for this channel for our other social media links more content and to support our work please visit cittti.net dhanyawad namaskar <laughs>